They want to have fun. They're, they're fun. They're just fun, loving little hairy creatures. They have lots of hair, trolls. Makes me a little jealous. I'm not going to lie. Hi, I'm Kenny. It's the Animal Farm. So, how are you? You having a nice day so far? Having a good Thursday? That's good. Uh, DJ Willy Wow coming up in a little bit with a song that uh, I guess was inspired uh, by the King Kong vs. Godzilla movie or maybe uh, the movie, the, the, the song inspired the movie. I don't know. Either way, it's an epic battle and it's coming up in musical form. It'll be fun. We've also got a princess who will save herself, movie music from Chicken Little, and a voicemail message for a chipmunk. Yes, we get through that a lot. You know, a lot of, a lot of voicemail messages that we have to go through on a regular basis. And you guys have been great. Avi, thank you very much for your messages for Dirk, Emma, and Rachel calling in. Eli's a big Slamilton fan. Uh, Emma loves, uh, I think I mentioned that she left a message for Dirk and with her sister Rachel, but she also loves the llama. And Nika, happy early uh, birthday to you. Nika's birthday is on May 6th, so happy early birthday to you. Thanks for playing around with us at the Animal Farm. Here's another voicemail message. Somebody's on the phone! Hi, my name is Dirk. I'm calling from Chicken Little. I just wanted to say Snake or something Snake along those. Go, I would right. have to vote no. I'm just going to say that right now. I mean, okay. you know, I'm an accepting suit. I believe there's room for everyone to each his own. Sure. You know, you do you. I do me. Right. I get it. I respect you. But? But I don't want to be anyone's lunch or, or supper for that matter. So, <laughs> you know, really. Okay. No, I'm going to. I would. I, would I, I don't think. Not sure how you define fun, but to me, that wouldn't be as fun. You know? Well, you know what? That's a fair point. I can see why you wouldn't be comfortable with that. Yeah, um, and I don't want to have a poisonous, you know, anything poisonous. I don't want to have a poisonous animal around. It's a, I think you mean venomous animal, a venomous animal. Poisonous. No, uh, venomous animals inject toxins into their victims. Poisonous animals are toxic when they're eaten. So there's actually a difference between the two. Well, I'm pretty sure, Kenny, that if you ate a rattlesnake, you would be poisoned. Uh, I'm just saying, I, I think it might be poison. I don't know, actually. Also venomous. Okay, fair enough. But, right. you know, Whatever. I'm just... Okay. Yeah. All yeah. right. I'm just trying to... What? Make myself seem less foolish, really, is what I'm trying okay. to do. Okay. Uh, right. But, well, uh, yeah. Well, thank you for the suggestion. Yeah. Uh, of course, Kenny, this, you know, we can talk about this offline, but... I'm just going <laughs> to say, please no, please no, please, please no. no. All right, that's fine. Things. It would be very nice. You know, I would like to point out that we did have a snake here at one point, and you guys got along really well. Well, that was different, wasn't it? I mean, I mean you know, again, oh. not a venomous snake. He was a, you know, he was a, uh, a python. A boa you constrictor. Know. Julius Squeezer. Yeah. Delightful. Yeah. Julius, I loved Julius. He was wonderful. Julius was great. He got transferred, but, you know, we, we had a wonderful friendship. Well... Big on hugs. Very big on hugs. Yeah, he <laughs> liked to hug you a lot. I remember pulling you out of some of those. I think he's just being affectionate. Yeah? You know, who doesn't want to hug this? I mean, well, look at I... me. You want to hug me right now, don't you? Well, not like Julius Squeezer did. Okay, right. Anyway, the point was Julius <laughs> Squeezer not, you know, included. Okay. I would prefer, you know, to not have snakes that might want to eat me on the phone. I'm just right. saying. Fine, that's fine. I don't think that would be fun. Okay. 